in the perfect ideal world that we all want to live in, and maybe will live in one day, there are no gender biases that exist. And the playing field is completely flat for everybody. In the world in which we live today, gender biases still exist. And so I found during my career and engaging with women about how they've been successful, that being very clear about what success is, is a means to success. In a lot of jobs today, you know, we get into that year-end review and as women we're hearing, you know, you were a little too aggressive and you were, you didn't play exactly correctly, or you're a little too, you held back too much. And we, the research tells us there is this double bind for women where by the way we act at work is a pretty slender thread. So how do we work around that or how do we work with that? Beforehand, we say, okay, what is success, right? Exactly what, how many new clients is it? Yeah, what kind of um, new product rollout, what, you know, when is the presentation due, et cetera. What does success look like, both for myself and for the department overall? What should sales be? And so that when you get into that end of year review, you understand what your key performance metrics are, and you talk about those, and it's a means to pulling away a bit some of the gender issues.